vlog is starting late because this morning was a fiasco. <laughs> it was not fun. I'm here at my friend's house and uh, yeah. Oh, there's your cat. Watch out, cat. Little pigs, little pigs, let me come in. I'll buy the hair of my chinny chin chin. <laughs> what is that? This is one heck of a booze collection. It's kind of dark, can't really see everything. But yeah. <laughs> My friends and watching Total Recall. Total Recall is on. With Arnold Schwarzenegger. So, on the other note, uh, news for me. Uh, I actually got an upgraded phone. Yes, this is uh, this device here. Um, I'm still learning how to use it. I have no idea how because I've never had a phone like this. But uh, I'm with the help of my friends. I'm understanding a little bit more, so we shall see how that goes. Bad Jack's got a new phone. Yep, still candy canes. Figure they'll leave it up for uh, January. I had gotten phone updates from him. Um, Help me do stuff with my phone. But again I'm getting used to this phone situation so uh, I got to see some pretty neat updates or upgrades whatever you want to call them that I didn't know kind of exist so 60 degrees out tonight very little moon it's fairly dark and cold out and I, I must say these last three nights pretty darn cold I know other places is a lot colder wow it is like dead quiet out here closing this door I can't believe how still it is out there. Still of the night. Roy Scheider and Mara Streep. Was that 1982? It was a cool movie. I like that movie. Alright. Well, get into the light so you can see. Yeah. Crazy. It's a cold one. You cold? Oh, you don't want to be filmed? Or are you going to be filmed? No, oh, no, no. Yeah, new phone. <laughs> I 
late night tonight, but I got the got some stuff to do in the morning. Um, I'm going to go over to uh, get some more uh, material for the the main channel. So I'm gonna go to my friend's shop and do that. He's got some got some extra stuff we can photograph, which is always good. Hey, you're always jumping. Oh yeah, trying to figure out how to use my new phone and uh, yeah just kind of working with that I'm not used to that stuff because I never had a phone like that so it's all new stuff to me and for most of you that probably have those types of phones it's a walk in a park not a big deal but for me it's uh, I'm getting used to it it's but like I said tonight actually my friend that uh, he's really computer savvy and everything he was able to show me some pretty neat things on it uh, he set up a nice cool background on the phone uh, some Freddy Krueger stuff and uh, set my uh, a ringtone wow I didn't even <laughs> so uh, yeah I'm it's just a lot to take in for me uh, just right now it's like I'm just like I feel barraged with a lot of information that I'm like ah, oh yeah I don't quite understand it yet but uh, anyway what I did this morning, I know, what was what was going on this morning? Well, this morning was a simple, was supposed to be a very simple uh, go to the post office, mail some stuff off, and uh, it didn't work out that way. I had two boxes to mail, and this, this I went and got help from my friend of mine, and he has a account with them, so it was going to be a lot cheaper. And, of course, he deals with shipping uh, a lot so I went to him for help and okay so just imagine take a moment how long do you think it would take to pack two boxes with merchandise tape it put a label on it and take it down to FedEx and mail it okay take a moment all right I'll put the stop or whatever pause the video and put down your answer how long that would take just just your guess how long would it take for you to put some items in a box slap some tape on there print out a label put it on there take it down to FedEx and mail it okay simple operation how long do you reckon that would take okay um you know what my guess is mm, 45 minutes tops, tops we're talking, okay? And that's including the time to go down there and, 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 and be in the place, okay? You wanna know how long it took? Six hours, yeah, I know. Uh, I, if you're still sitting on your chair and, or if you haven't spit your coffee up at the, the screen, dripping down with coffee, but yes. Um, let's see. What's the easiest way to put this? I'm not trying to talk uh, bad about my friend or anything, but you ever meet people that just overthink things? And I mean overthink everything. Uh, overthink just walking out to the car to open the door. Yeah. There is a point in life where you overthink everything. You can overthink things. You can overbuild things. Um, you can overdo things. You can over-engineer things. Uh, unnecessary costs, time, measures, all that stuff. So, <laughs> anyhow, um, yeah, I'm gonna get out of here, you guys, and call it the day. Uh, tomorrow, I'm gonna wake up pretty early to get up to my friend's place. My, uh, he has a shop in town. I got some stuff to uh, film there for the main channel. So, at least stuff like uh, will come out. Um, I got a video ready to go. Uh, we'll probably publish it out Wednesday on the main channel. Uh, basically a look at the Colt Series 80 style 1911, a more of a, a detailed closer look at it and what, what it entails. Cause I, uh, for me, being into 1911s, 
I've always heard that like, oh, you know, the Series 80, you don't want the Series 80, the, you know, I've heard so much stuff back and forth about it. After owning a Series 80, I'm like, this is one of the best 1911s I got. I love shooting it. It looks great. It's awesome. And uh, so there you go. If I would have listened to these other people trying to change my mind about it, I would have never gotten to own such an awesome 1911. So I wanted to do a video that kind of just showed how really there's not much difference in those guns. Um, but, you know, I don't know. I've never noticed anything with the trigger pull and all that. But you'll see all that in the video on Wednesday on the main channel. Um, yeah. So we're looking at the, the last video on there, the radio show. Will Colt bring back all the snake guns? I don't know. <laughs> Hopefully they do. Hopefully it brings the prices of those snake guns down back to come back to earth snake guns. <laughs> so, all right, that's going to be it. I'm going to see you tomorrow. And yeah, Bat Jack's got a new phone. I'm working on it. Hopefully I can get better at it. <laughs> you know, because uh, I guess, I don't know. Everybody kept telling me it's time to get with the times. I don't know. I'm learning. <laughs>